went to the emergency room three times a day. I got no labs done on me. Well, at UPMC Mercy Hospital, they did labs on me, but they only gave me my blood glucose test. Like, you know, that's saying something, you know. I keep my blood sugar low because I know I'm a type 1 diabetic that the FBI won't diagnose. So, I tell them all the time, my, my blood sugar should be low for drinking lettuce juice, uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. FBI is killing uh, Emily Lavallo. And none of these people will suffer medically how they treated me because they're doing the FBI's wet work for them. Wet work is murder work for them. So they'll be rewarded for killing the nigger. Uh, after <coughs> I talked to Andrew Burr, the FBI killer, he kept on saying he got me and he understands and he believes me. You know, they put an IV in my arm. I knew I wasn't going to get IV fluids, though, because they gave it to me as soon as they put it in my arm. They just drew blood, drew blood. And the FBI's killer, Emmy Lavallo, she tells me, oh, what's your one thing that bothers you the most? Only the FBI asked this. Only the FBI asked only your one thing. This is why I go to the hospital for it. How am I not getting that you admitted to UPMC hospitals when I got UPMC insurance? My insurance doesn't mean nothing with the FBI full control of my health care. But she asked me, like I stated in the earlier video, why do you I think I'm dehydrated? Uh, why do I think I'm dehydrated? She did not want to watch my video. She's talking about FBI killer Andrew Burr. Because I showed him the videos, told him about her. But she asked me, why do I think I'm life-threatening dehydrated? This is how much I urinated since Wednesday. And by the time I wake up tomorrow, if I go to sleep, if I don't call 911 back again, because I keep feeling this way, I will. Um... But, you know, this killer's ass to me. Um, Emily Lavallo, why do I feel like I'm life-threatening dehydrated? And she told me as long as I can drink water, then I don't need IV fluids. Only niggers get treated this way. And the FBI is getting away with this shit. This is the sad thing. I'm doing everything in my power to save my life. The FBI will say they're so diabolical and evil because... I made three trips to the emergency room. Three is an FBI frame number. And, you know, it's part of your criminal conspiracy sanity. But I don't think anybody with common sense knows, especially you medical professionals out there that has no affiliation with the federal government, knows that I'm urinating like this every day. And this is how much I urinated in a single day, a little over a day, that there's no way I, should be, I shouldn't be getting admitted to the hospital. Especially, especially UPMC when I have UPMC insurance. Um, I asked the FBI killers, "Can I get copies of my copies of my EKG?" They talk about they was gonna put them on my discharge papers. These was on my discharge. This was my discharge papers. Hold on. And I will be putting these discharge papers on the link of this video. Of course, they got some COVID information on here. Because that's the, that's still a backdoor murder cover for the FBI. Uh, this is one of the FBI doctors they took over. Linenbaum and Associates. This is when I went there when I was coughing up blood and... Uh, one of their FBI killers gave me Robitussin for it. And I was coughing up blood in his office. I still got the, that pneumonia in my chest. My blood pressure was 79 over 52. At, uh, at UB, UPMC uh, Shadyside. And I still got no medical treatment. FBI still won't hydrate me. Uh, frequent urination. It says, when to seek for help. I'm, I'm going to see what the FBI put here, because I'm pretty sure this shit happens to me every day. Uh, 
You have blood or, blood or pus in your urine. That's every day. You have chills and body aches every day. It hurts to urinate. It burns when I urinate every day. You have growing of belly pain. Belly pain every day. You have pain in your back just below your rear cord every day. You see, nowhere on these discharge papers, the FBI put links to my uh to my EKGs. Because those EKGs will say my heart's enlarged. I have abnormal heart rhythms because I have LVH. Because the FBI left me severely anemic because of these infections in my body. What type of hospital, when you ask for EKG results, they don't put it on your discharge papers? Talk about, I go to the help desk. We'll put it on your... What help desk? Like I said, I'll... I'm taking pictures of these, of these discharge papers. There's no information about where I can get a copy of my EKG at on here. Because the FBI knows, if people know that my heart is enlarged and I got abnormal heart rhythms, I should never be discharged from the hospital. But the FBI killers, Lavello and Burr, the FBI is using two doctors to cushion my mistreatment. Uh, they both decided me urinating like this was not a medical emergency, and, and, and as long as I can still swallow, then I don't need medical treatment. They offered me a cup of water to hydrate myself. They also won't. They also won't do any ultrasounds on my leg. This is how you murder, torture, and frame an innocent nigger in the city of Pittsburgh. And I guess, you know, their federal agent with dreadlocks handed me a clipboard. That was all the FBI needed for them to deny me medical treatment today. A fucking clipboard. This was all my life was worth and how easily it was taken away.